and I just ran straight into that, and there goes all my rings. The hard part of getting in this, like, I mean, the problem is that it costs 50 rings to get into the bonus stage, which is hard enough to get, especially in the later levels. But even then, once you get into the bonus stage, the bonus stages are hard as heck. So, yeah, that's what makes it so difficult to get the Chaos Symbols in this game. Although, to be fair, it wasn't much easier to get, like, 50 rings and beat a level in Sonic 1. What? What? Why? Okay. Oh, yeah. Pretty much. I mean, you are the one that does and records everything, so... And apparently... I'm not even gonna pay attention to what he was just holy crapping about. But apparently we're gonna go the hard way, which is underwater. So that's... that's fun. And we're already drowning. As you can see, this game gives you water a lot earlier than Sonic 1 did. Because Sonic 1 gave it to you in Zone 4. And all the zones had three acts in that game, so... The first water level was level 10. In this game, it's level 5. So, yeah. This game is a lot harder than Sonic 1. What about sucking? Did you... Oh, I thought you said you... I thought I suck. I was like, I'm actually doing really good for once. Well, I... I can't even tell if you're talking about the game or me. Because half the time... Well, I can't hear what you're saying because of these headphones. And I w really wish I could stop hearing the drowning music because it's really annoying. Um, bubble, please. Game. Game. Thank you. I om the game almost just, like, killed me. Like, for no reason. And I almost just got squashed by that thing. That's just lovely. For the same reason I don't like sports games. Alright, I know there's a um, checkpoint up here, so I'm trying not to die, epically. Oh, look at that dodge. That was an epic dodge right there. Yes. I try to make my commentary interesting, because, you know, the majority of my commentary lately has just been, seriously, can I please beat the level to Super Meat Boy? Which is why I wanted to start this game, because I knew that this game would be a lot more interesting. And as you can see in this special stage, they start putting rings on the roof. Because they're evil. I don't know what you're talking about, Matthew. I'm not paying attention to you. I'm trying to beat a special stage. If I can actually get the fifth... Chaos Emerald in this, we might actually manage to get all the Chaos Emeralds, which would be freaking insane. And we got through the second spot. Oh wow, we need to get a lot of rings. Um, yeah, I was five rings short, Matthew. <laughs> I was five rings away from winning. 
Um, yeah. That was kind of like that one time. I remember back when I was a kid, I got to the seventh special stage, and I was one ring away from, be from beating it. Words do not describe how much hate and anger there was. And I'm just gonna, like, beat this boss with no rings, because I'm freaking awesome at this game. Unlike Super Meat Boy, which I suck at. And he's dead, and we beat level 3. I don't even know how much I'm gonna record. Cause... Cause I mean, this game isn't that long, and I don't wanna record that much, but... While you're here, we might as well record as much as we possibly can. <sighs> Casino Night Zone, Zone 4. We're doing actually really good. We have four Chaos Emeralds by Zone 4. That's pretty much average, I think. Well, technically, I mean, the last um, checkpoints... Like, I mean, the last checkpoints in the game are in um, Zone 10, so we need to get all... If we do get all the Chaos Emeralds... What, Matthew? Yeah. I remember that that night that you spent over and we played Pokemon Rumble all night, I ended up, like, entering a state of half-consciousness. You were awake. I basically was awake, but I couldn't hear anything. And, like, every few seconds I would, like, be on an acid trip, essentially, because everything would get all colorful and, like, weird. So I think that... I started, like, I think I started hallucinating, basically. But the only thing was that I was, well, yeah, I was technically hallucinating, because I was seeing real life, but with all kinds of weird colors, and I apparently just went to a wall and got a 1-up. Awesome. Cool story, bro. Is essentially that entire thing I just said. I wish I could find a checkpoint. I don't like this level, by the way. I mean, I like the design of the level, but I don't like playing this level, because you bounce all over the place, and it's really hard. And now he's talking about hard levels. You don't even know about hard levels, Matthew. Um, can I please get a checkpoint game? I don't want to, like, not have... I'm at the end of the level already. And I don't think it's possible to go back. Nope. Oh well. No Chaos Emeralds in that stage at all. We might be able to get something in the next act. Although, to be fair, Beating this game really fast wouldn't necessarily be a bad thing, because I'm extremely psyched to get on with my next project. The you-know-what project. Um... I'm not sure how to, like, give you a hint without giving it out to my entire audience. Um, I'm kind of playing a game right now. Um, what can you... Like, what are you talking about? I'm not sure what that one game is. No. I'm not sure if they just heard you, but it's not on Steam, by the way. So... It, it's not originally a PC game. So it's gonna be, a, like, a ROM like it is with this game. Essentially. I'll just, um, 
Actually, no, that wouldn't be a good hint. I'm not gonna say it, because it's not gonna be a good hint. And I can't think of anything right now, because I'm in a bonus stage. Alright, section one complete. Can we do section two? Probably not. What? At what? At what? I don't have nearly enough subscribers to get a job at Machinima. I just want some subscribers. Alright, we got enough rings to get the Chaos Emerald. Five, 